The Australian Open a week away. We have some big names that are not actually playing the Australian Open and also some big names that are in trouble going into the Australian Open because of some injury concerns. Let's go have a look at who has actually pulled out officially from the 2024 Australian Open first. Starting on the men's side, only a couple of names have withdrawn so far. Stricker, he's pulled out. Of course, Rafa Nadal, the biggest name so far to pull out, unfortunately, injuring his hip again and needs to go and rest and recover. Oh yeah, Polka has also pulled out of this year's Australian Open. And the last one being Nick Kyrgios pulling out. He actually didn't even enter the draw or go in the entry list. So that's why he's not even on the list, but he also will be missing this year's Australian Open because of injury. On the ladies' side, the big one, Mukova, pulling out of the Australian Open, unfortunately still injured from the end of last season, so she won't be playing. Madison Keys also pulling out of the Australian Open, which is a shame. Kvitova, she's also pulled out because she's having a baby, so she won't be at the event. And Belinda Bencic also pulling out of the event because she is also having a baby. So some big names there that are not going to be playing at this year's Australian Open on the women's side. Having a look at the players that are coming in with some injury concerns, Starting with a big one, Novak Djokovic coming in with a wrist problem that he got in practice for the United Cup. We'll monitor his actions over the next couple of days, but he's coming in with that wrist injury. It seems like every year he comes in with some sort of injury at the Australian Open. Potapova also coming in with an injury concern. She had to pull out of her match against Rybakina in Brisbane, so keep an eye on her moves over the next couple of days. Alina Svetolina, now she did play the final against Goff in Auckland, but she did have some medical timeouts in the semi-final and the final, so might be coming in with some foot problems at this year's Australian Open. And Aslan Karatsev, he had a knee problem in his first match in Brisbane, which forced him to retire. So another player there that's done well in Australia before. So there you have it. Big names that are not playing. Big names that have some injury concerns. I guess you could also throw in players like Oje Aliassime and City Pass because both of them haven't really played that much, especially FAA. He hasn't played at all at the United Cup and City Pass picked and choose who he was going to play or where he was going to play. So maybe those guys could also be on that injury list, but massive names. Who's going to play? Who's not going to play is more important. Let me know down in the comments below. Do you think we're going to get those big names I mentioned playing or not? Especially Djokovic. We're definitely monitoring him over the next couple of days because in Rafa's case, we thought he might be okay for playing the Australian Open and then all of a sudden he pulls out and he's not playing. So some big names there to watch out for at the Australian Open on the injury list. Some big names that aren't going to play.